Live from Walla Rink in North Andover, Massachusetts, it's Merrimack College men's hockey, the championship of the Turkey Lake Classic, as the Merrimack Warriors get set to take on the Bentley Falcons. Junior from Chicago, Illinois, spent a couple of years up in Maine. Look out the center, broken up. Orodienko with that steal over the line to Wyland. Wyland, far circle, he'll wind one wide. Bookman will fire one, tip score! Bookman fired the shot, it was tipped in front, and Mike Merrimack will take the one nothing lead. Luke Wyland will get credit for the goal. Dewar, back over the lay, he fires one, that hit a leg. Falcons will get it back up top for Boken. He'll swing it to the fire circle, now Boken center point. Lay. Holding, he'll fire one, score! Power play goal for Bentley. Lots of bodies in front there, Mike. And uh, they had a man in front. Red hot hockey. Red hot hockey, indeed. Back to the point, quick shot. Olas gets the pad on it. They jam at it and they knock it home. Olas made the initial save, but Bentley wound up getting a fortuitous bounce and Chase Davis is there to knock it home, Mike, and the Falcons take the lead. There's a pass broken up along the boards down low for Bentley by Matt Thompson. Yeah, scoop it back up on top. Falcons at the far circle. They'll get a one-time attempt. It's right there and it's banged in. Olas made the save and the puck actually was on the goal line after the initial save. Bentley continued to poke at it and Matt Thompson able to knock it home. It's three to one Bentley. And so uh, times are very good. For Bentley. As the Warriors bring the puck in the offensive zone, here's Welsher. He'll put the brakes on. Welsher sends the puck to home. Jeffries in front. Point blank save and a score on the rebound. That looked like Tano crashing the net. What a weekend he's having. And Merrimack, you talk about the greasy goals, Mike. There's one. It's 3 to 2. Falcons 17th in the country on the penalty kill entering play today. And they're aggressive to the puck, too. Forsmark lays one across. Again, a lot of teams a lot more passive on the PK, just trying to fill lanes. They're aggressive to the puck. They put pressure on, on teams in the power play. In the slot, save, score! Forsmark connects on the power play. And that couldn't have been any easier. Forsmark was right there, and he ties the game on the power play. And sometimes when you pressure teams in the power play like that, when you only got four defenders in the ice, it will create some open space. And Philip Forsmark found some open space here as the puck goes cross ice. Forsmark ends up alone right on the back door. And again, a second chance goal. That's the way most of them are scoring nowadays. As they have a couple of games out there, December 1st and 2nd next weekend. So a plane trip coming up for the Falcons. Merrimack keeps the play alive. There's a shot by Brown. Broken stick on the ice. Merrimack trying to take advantage. Shot by Jeffrey. Scores! Alex Jeffries with 55 ticks on the clock. Puts Merrimack ahead. A broken stick helped the Warriors there, Mike. Broken stick allowed him to keep the puck in the zone. And man, the patience here from Alex Jeffries is impressive. He's been impressive all year. And one of the best forwards in the league, one of the best forwards in the country. And you see him end up with the puck here in front of the net. A lot of guys panic in that spot. He's alone, held the puck just long enough to make Grabko go down, give him all the room in the world for the goal. That's a that's a goal scorer's play from a guy who's going to be playing for a long time. That's an impressive patience from him there. I've been is uh, blocked wide of the net. Now Gallant has it for Merrimack down low. Warriors turn it over. Bentley with a chance. Olas is there. Bendorf had the opportunity. And Hugo Olas able to make the save. We'll step aside. 13.06 remaining. Now to the circle. Quick shot. Deflected. Durasevic gets a stick on it. And the Falcons will work it back up on top. There are 10 seconds to play. Horsaga, far circle. They get it to Bendorf. Shot, blocker, pad, save, Olas. Four seconds to go. Merrimack has possession. They'll send it down ice. It goes wide of the net, but time will expire. And the Turkey Lake Championship goes to the Merrimack Warriors. As we wind up playing a scoreless third period, but Mike, the three goal rally in the second pushed the Warriors to victory. Yeah, that's a, this is a hard game. I mean, this is a good Bentley team that plays hard, plays physical. Coaches always say they want non-conference games to get you ready for your, your in-conference play, your in-league play. This one definitely did, for sure. This is a, a well-earned blue-collar victory for the Warriors against a hard-working, physical Bentley team.